Okay. I think I can barely see because of the fog. <laughs> this would be a great time to spend the night in the end. What is that? War. There are no, no, there are no threats to me. I... You know what? This is too dangerous. I can barely see where I'm going in these marshy lands. So I am going to make my way back to Kildare after all. And uh, we'll come back in the mor in the morning. It's just I can barely see. Hopefully the the uh, fog will have lifted. Let me uh, save it. Can't even see where I'm going now. Let's see. Let's go to local. No. This is not the way. Where goes this? I feel like I'm blind. Temperature is not that bad. It's only 82 degrees in the, in the graphics card. It did go up to 90 before I started recording, but it doesn't seem that bad right now. Um, let's see. Again, thankfully I mapped these areas and so I can use my local map to tell me if I'm following the roads and they'll keep me out of danger. But... And we made it to the safety of the walls of Caldera. What is it, Traveler? What do you see? I seek it in, and I know where it is, so, uh, thank you, but no thank you. In the morning we shall, s as long as we're here, we shall sell some wares. Please, by all means, I'm listening. And I think it's a good time for Marcus to have a meal, a small meal, he's not going to have a lot. It is late at night, it's 11 p.m., so maybe he's going to have some bread. And, uh, Shank, we want a bed. It's foggy out there, we don't want to be going out in the world. And we can't even see in front of our noses. Uh, thank you. Good night. 
see. Uh, I remember where. I think I remember where the room was. Not here. Over here. This is the room. Okay. Let's. Having a problem with glare on my screen. That's one of the reasons why I can't see that well. Okay. Let's get. Take out my shield, my axe, my helmet, my boot, and then I take off my. Gauntlets, my pauldrons, and then take up the cuirass. And we'll take the shirt off, and we'll go to bed. And we are going to sleep. Uh, Let's see, 12 hours would be 11 o'clock. 10 hours would be 9 o'clock. Nine hours would be 8 o'clock. So we're going to sleep a nice 9 hours, I think. 8 o'clock is a good time to wake up. So, we will see you in the morning at 8 o'clock sharp. Okay, good morning. It's the start of another day. Let's hope that the weather is more favorable. <laughs> Close the door of this room that I rented. I guess I'm not. Usually, when I do these LPs, it's usually late at night. That's why I have so much glare during the day. And that's why I usually don't have problems with this. So I'll see. And as well, it's still foggy, but it's at least daytime, and I can see what I'm doing. I did say I was going to stop at a shop. <clears throat> Hello. I want to barter. I... Let's go... I want to sell. That's... I think that's mine. I was going to sell that, that, that's mine. You know what, I just realized... Cancel. I just walked out the naked. I'm almost naked. Oh. Let's find some place to hide in the stairwell. Will be good enough to get back dressed. I'll at least put a shirt on. And uh, some uh, shoes. Not extravagant. Some shoes. So. Yeah, yeah, that looks a lot better, so... Well, now we'll talk to him. Barter. Now. miscellaneous Weapons. We'll get through that. 
those and that. Parallel. We'll get that's my stuff. And that's my stuff I wanna keep. Magic I'll keep this up. and miscellaneous I think we wanna keep it. Okay, offer reoffer two hundred and seventy four gold. Thank you. Appreciate doing business. Let's uh get dressed for a trip. We will put we'll start with our boots and our cuirass. Then we'll put the pauldrons on. Pauldron. Then the gauntlet. Then the helmet. Shield. And finally, uh, and finally, the weapon. We'll quit that for now. And then we'll put something else. Okay. That's what time is it? It's 8 a.m. Let's get a move on it. Ah, uh, yes. What is it? Nothing. Well, hello there. A pleasure to meet you. Are you talking to me or are you talking to him? Who would you talk to? Well met, Outlander. What is it? I'm not an Outlander. I'm here from Tamriel. What are you talking well about? Well met, Outlander. What is it? Okay, we're out of there. Uh, yeah. Even though it's foggy, I can see a lot better than I could during the night. So, uh, getting lost will not be an issue. Add on. I guess when he first approached, I think when he first approached me, I, I decided that I didn't want any part of it at the time. And I think that upset him. People can be so sensitive. Gee, I was just taking care of business. We didn't wait for later. Oh, what's this? Uh, I am so... That did look something I can harvest. Fresh. This is something new. Cokeweed. Seen that around. You know what? I do need to improve my skills. I do not want to find another one of those things. 
Especially, I did not want to have to learn a practice with magic. To save my magic for when I need it so much. Look at this, it's so much better. Even though it's foggy out, I can still find my way. Wish the fog would clear up. Uh, there's the water I saw the other day, and here's the road. You see, if I didn't know, I would have headed on that way. But, couldn't tell where the road was last night. So, I like to stick to roads. I'm a road person. I like traveling in roads, and I like to stick to roads. Uh, I'll only go off the road if absolutely necessary. There's another war. They're friendly. I recognize this kind of place. This is like near St. Denis. Some kind of ingredients, some kind of uh, plant life. Very familiar. I, hate, I do hate hearing cliff breezes around. I never know where they are. Yeah, I'm gonna leave you alone. Don't bother me, and I won't bother you. And I prefer if you don't bother me, because I don't know if I can handle you. In combat. Skills are terrible. Marcus, you have terrible skills. Ooh, what's down here? Soon, probably some place I do not want to enter right away. I learned that lesson. Ooh. I think I see a hostile creature in there. I think I might want to try my hand at Northman since, since even though I like Direction. It's very costly. <sighs> we'll see. What is that? That is an enormous structure. My sense might be too hard, but uh, this might be over my head, but my sense of adventure is getting, wow, that's a big structure. I think that's one of the old ancient Denmark fortresses. 